welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, today I'm going to be styling my hair myself because that's one of the things I do. Um, this hairstyle is one that you can take to work, you can take to church or any event, a very simple event you're going to and maybe you're in a hurry. It takes like less than five minutes so watch me as I style my hair myself. So I already sectioned out my hair into five places um, just to make it easier to work with. Um, so in case you ever want to know the dye I use, I'll probably drop it in my in the comments. Right here. Um, I have been natural for so my hair isn't up to two years because I cut it two years ago and it hasn't still you know finished growing. So this hairstyle is a very simple updo. As I said, it wouldn't take more than five minutes. I'm just combing out my hair. So a few things you need. I know a lot of people don't like using rubber bands for their hair, but it's easier for me to work with. I use a rubber band and a pin. So I put this in like this. So now I'm going to section out the front of my hair which is going to serve as the pattern for the updo in the front section of my head. Okay, so basically I take enough hair to work with because I'm going to have two, um, I think it's called pompadours in front. Okay, so just enough hair for me to work with. Um, I'll comb this out a bit. I just put this aside. So, I'm going to apply some gel. Um, I don't use any particular brand of gel. Whatever works for my hair is what I use. Um, so, this is a hairstyle that is very focused on being in front, so it depends on the shape of your of your head. And I'll put some at the back as well. I use my brush and smoothing it out. So I'm ready to start initiating the pack. smooth. Now this is where I use the pin that I put up earlier. So I put the pin into the hair, make sure it comes out at the other side and take it around. Take it around like this. So one time and then put the pin in the other way. So now I have packed it up. Now with this hair that is left out, I'm just going to brush it straight so I can bend it over the back. So with this, I'm just going to hold it over like this and roll it over to the back. So I have it how I want it to be now. I'm just going to bend my hand over and then have it like this. And I'll use a bobby pin. And then hold it in place here. So make sure you pin it in a way that the pin doesn't show. So yeah, it's held in place. Now to the front section of the hair. So I'm going to divide this part into two. Okay, 
Okay, so I have one part and then this part. So it's divided into two. And I will hold this one down so it doesn't get in the way. With this, just make sure it's straight. And so what I'm going to do is something I'll probably do with bending rollers. But since I don't have that, using my finger. So I'll take it around my finger and bend it over to the front. So I'll take my pin and from under so that you are holding the edge of the hair and another pass just to secure the other end. You can choose between small and big pins, whichever works for you. If you do not follow to those things. That's one part. Now for the last part of it, this would also come towards the front and I would also use my hand to rotate. Now just to make sure that it's smooth, you can apply gel to both ends and then use this particular brush to brush the sides. Okay. So now that I have it straight and fine, and then remove your hand and keep bending it until you have this. Now because it's fragile, you need to clean it instantly. <laughs> Oops. So I'm just going to pull in place under. back secure and now for my sides if you like your edges slick um, you can slick your edges down so I'm just going to do that so you're ready to go to work to church to anywhere but if you want your edges to lay, you can put this scarf over for 5-10 minutes. So as I said, it's not compulsory to lay your edges. If you want to lay your edges, you can lay it. It's not compulsory because the technique I used to hold my hair down with the pin and the, and the rubber band actually keeps it in place tight enough so that your edges don't go loose. So I put this just at the edge. I'm going to look at the Taekwondo festival. So I tied this safely for five minutes. So welcome back. It's five minutes and it's time to unravel the hair. I'm just going to remove it. And I love the end result. So very easy to do, less than five minutes. Um, I, it was just because it's an explainer video, I took my time to explain. But if you want to do it in, like, without explaining, it's less than five minutes. Okay, thank you so much for watching. I'll be expecting you next time on my channel. Stay tuned. Don't forget to like and subscribe and tell your friends about it because my personal goal is to teach every girl how to style their hair with the minimum amount of money and with minimum tools thank you so much for watching again so see you next time bye